fast time, first time. Mark English for me really powered out the blocks. Oh, 100 meters in lanes. Then they hit some green cones on the back straight. They'll slip into lane one. Elliot Kristan running well on the inside. He's got to make sure he's not swallowed up by the pack. But I can't really see a, uh, someone that wants to lead there. It could be Elliot Kristan reluctantly leading five men across the track. Jay Whiteman positioning himself higher up than maybe he was in some of the opening rounds. And it's Valentini of Italy in the lead at the moment. Simon Valentini, the under-23 champion, leading the senior European championships. Mariano Garcia has made a big move around the outside, perhaps the Spaniard spotting that Jake Whiteman is pinned on the inside, but Jake Whiteman's got himself out. Ben Patterson isn't boxed. He said he was disappointed with some of his earlier races when he has been boxed. 52 seconds through the first 400. That's not super quick. This is going to be a burn-up over the second lap. Mariano Garcia trying to control this from the front. Mark English in third place at the moment. He's taking very close to the action, but the Irishman is boxed in. I think he should probably just relax and see if any gaps open up. Here comes Elliot Crestan. He's using a lot of speed down the back straight. He's going to get himself past Jake Whiteman onto the shoulder of Ben Patterson. There's a big group of five. Jake Whiteman swings wide into lane two. Mariano Garcia is going to come under a humongous amount of pressure in this home straight. It's 150 metres to go. Mariano Garcia, the world indoor champion, has the lead. Jake Whiteman, the world 1500 metre champion, is trying to kick. He's trying to get himself back. Mariano, plus Mariano Garcia, Mark English of Ireland at the moment. to Spain in the closing 10 metres Mariano Garcia found something extra he looked like surely he was going to suffer a similar fate as Jakob Ingebrigtsen and not be able to match Great Britain Northern Ireland's Jake Whiteman in the closing stages personal best for Mariano Garcia when you're already a world indoor champion and then you set a personal best in a championship race that is a fantastic run from the Spaniard he let everybody else mess around behind and change their order Jake Whiteman ran incredibly wide around that final bend. Mark English stuck to the inside like glue. He was not held back by the athletes in front of him. He ran the shortest line and rewarded with a brilliant bronze medal for Ireland. What a race. It was exciting, it was spicy, it was open. Everyone had a chance of a medal. And Garcia, well, it was similar to the World Championships 1500 metres in that the athlete you thought that might just open up their stride and come through down the outside. Inga Brinitsen, in that case, Whiteman tonight just didn't. Garcia held on magnificently. And it's a gold medal for Spain. And yes, you rightly mentioned uh, English's bronze medal. Some inspiring performances from Ireland, from Ola Tunde, Alalecki, the women's 4x4, then Kira McGeehan. You almost felt like the distance runners felt under pressure to match the sprinters, and they've certainly done that. Mariana Garcia, for me, that was a really smart move for the round about 450 metres to go. I don't know if he realised that Jake Whiteman, perhaps the biggest danger to him in this field, was boxed. Or he, oh, he realised it's not that slow. It's not going to take me a massive effort to get into the lead. I might as well do it and then have that pole position. Elliot Cristan put in a huge move down the back straight. It was unlikely that the Belgian athlete could have anything to respond again over the final 200 metres. And for me, Jake Whiteman, he is a brilliant tactician, but... He looked at the margin that he lost that gold medal, and surely he ran much further than that in the final 200 metres. Mariano Garcia just managed to get that inside lane, run the shortest route. Mark English as well, a similar tactical decision, I think would have brought that bronze medal to fruition for him. But what a brilliant race at men's 800 metres for all the drama we expected. Mariano Garcia, a champion. Saw a couple of race walking champions out on the road. I think that could be Spain's first gold medal here. Oh, we had one in the men's high hurdles. And the race walking. Men's 800 meter results Mariano Garcia, personal best 144.